I remember when our professors at Sam Houston State University were telling us that we were going to be going to Kaufman Elementary School to complete our field experience. And everybody knew of this legend of the Science Sisters. And everybody had said that they were these crazy, wacky ladies at that school that just loved science. And they made students interested in science. And they found ways to engage the students in science activities. My name is Avery. Uh, I'm part of the Science Sisters. I don't like science. I actually love it because you get to do experiments and goggles and my own jacket so I could be part of the Science Sisters and besides who doesn't like science. The experiment we're doing today, um, we're, we're doing a whole unit on matter and um, instead of just introducing matter like uh, this is a solid, show them the pictures, this is a liquid, this is a gas, we do all that but we also want them to uh, have hands-on experience with the solid. So today, solid is of course a paper airplane. Um, real, really the solid is the paper. They're folding the paper airplane and they're just gonna get to play around with it and add different properties like how far it flew, uh, the shape of it. Instead of it just being a green piece of paper, now it's a paper airplane. It's a solid, it's, it's, it keeps its shape. And then we'll eventually come back to that paper airplane and talk about physical changes. Our team is called the Cougar Bots. The original team was formed last year. It's a very popular program. Our kids have a lot of fun. They program the robot, they build it, they build the Lego obstacles for the robot. They work together. They're very, very, very curious. They brainstorm a solution to a problem and they think of a way to solve that problem on their own. It's research intensive. They work together as a group, they bounce ideas off each other, they make suggestions to each other, there's a lot of sportsmanship. Lots of high energy in the room as they work together. The room is designed for students ages 9 to 14. Our kids are younger than that and it's unbelievable what they can accomplish with their young minds when they work together as a team. The Destination Imagination is a great way to inspire curiosity and creativity in children. Too many of our children today seek playgrounds that are all the same. They work math problems that have one answer. And this doesn't develop curiosity, but Destination Imagination is open-ended with open-ended possibilities for every child.